Well, let me say this, first of all. This program is not in the doldrums, okay? I mean, they won 37 games last year. They won three games in the SEC tournament. They won a game in the regional. They're close. There's talent on this team. I know there's talent on this team. So, you know, people say, oh, you know, how many years is going to take? Look, I don't have a three-year plan. I don't have a five-year plan. I got a one-year plan. This team, the kids that are on this team that only have one more year of eligibility, they don't care about two years from now or three years from now. We're going to go out there and do the very best that we can this coming year. And if we do a little bit more to supplement the, 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 the team that we have coming back through recruiting and transfer portal and so forth, I don't see why we can't compete for, for everything right out of the gate. I didn't come here to lose. I didn't come here to be mediocre. In my opinion, Carolina baseball represents excellence. Ray Tanner, listen, Bobby Richardson and June Raines and, and Ray Tanner, all these great coaches of the past, they, they, they didn't work so hard to build a mediocre, mediocre team. They're not happy with mediocrity, and nor will I. This is my last go around. I'm not working anywhere after here, okay? This is it. So I think we need to win now. I think we should go for it. I don't know if it's going to happen. You know, it's a tough league. I don't know if you know that, but it's a tough league, okay? And we're going to go out there and we're going to compete our you-know-what's off every day. And if we get a few breaks and, and we make it happen. But I think the attitude of the players is going to dictate everything. If they're disciplined, if they care about the little things, it starts with how they conduct themselves. It starts with how they keep the locker room. It's how they respect their facility. It's how they interact with the public. It's all those kinds of things that if they're totally dedicated to a cause and we have the discipline and maybe we teach them how to handle the pressure situations a little bit better, okay, make a big pitch, get a big hit, make a big play, run the bases, take pride in the base running. You know, it's a, it's a cumulative thing that doesn't just happen overnight. You got to do it every day. You got to be a champion every day if you really want to hold up the big trophy at the end. And those were, those were characteristics of Ray's teams when, when they were really winning big. I don't see any reason why we can't just restore that glory. And again, if we recruit the right players, coach them the right way, you know, be dedicated to them and they're dedicated to the team, I don't see any reason why we should put limits on what we accomplish.